this tutorial is going to show you how to add an external calendar to your Outlook calendar. So in other words, if I had a Gmail or other web-based calendar, I could have it show up here with my other shared calendars. So the first thing we have to do is go to that web calendar, and I'm going to use the GFPS calendar. So I need to find that, and I'm just going to Google. And I'm looking for the iCal subscription. Okay, find the master calendar. And I have to choose which calendar I want. And I want the district meetings and events. So I have to wait for that calendar to come up here. Because that's the calendar I want to see. And now I've got these icons up here. And one of them is this email icon. And really that's a subscription icon. So I'm going to click here to subscribe. And I don't want emails to come to me. I want the iCalendar feed so that it feeds in to my Outlook calendar. And as soon as something new is added onto this calendar, it will go onto my Outlook calendar. So I want the calendar feed and I want district meetings and events. Notice that you could put Great Falls High, CMR, you could do whichever one you want. And if you want more than one, just do this more than one time. I'm going to select that calendar. Or I could put two of them. If I wanted the district meeting and east, I could put them all on one calendar. But I like to put them on separate calendars so that I have more than one feed on my Outlook. Okay, so now that I've done that, I'm going to want this web calendar link. So I'm going to copy that link, Control C or right click and copy. Then I'm going to go to my Outlook calendar. And I'm going to click on this folder tab um, where I can go to open calendar from the internet. And I'm going to paste that feed in there and click OK. And it asks me if I want to add this calendar and subscribe to updates. Yes, that's exactly what I want to do. And so it's contacting that calendar out on the web. And now I'll see that it's right here under other calendars called iCal feed. And it's shown up here so I can do all the things that I normally can do. I can overlay them, look at it by itself. I can't add anything to this calendar, but I could certainly drag and drop these onto my own personal calendar. Events, if I wanted one on my personal calendar, I could drag and drop it on here. I can also right click this and rename it and say this is district events and I could repeat this process if I wanted East Middle School or Great Falls High also on here. So that's how you can add an external calendar onto your regular Outlook. Um, you could do the same thing with the Gmail calendar. You're looking for the iCal in there. So here's how you would add your Google Calendar. You want to bring up your Google Calendar and then notice I have two calendars. I'll say I want this one. I want to pull down here and say Calendar Settings. Underneath Settings, I can scroll down and I can see that I have this iCal here under Private Address. I'm going to click the iCal Calendar. This is what I'm going to copy. Copy that. Go into my Outlook and I'm going to repeat that process of underneath Open um, and from the Internet paste that in, click OK, say yes, and now that calendar has been added into um, let me change this to week view so we can see some activity in here. It's been added into my other calendars. So I hope that helped you add an external calendar into your Outlook.